Hello, everybody! Welcome to our new Let's Play. Let's go me alongside Banjo Kazooie. I didn't actually expect to be doing this right now. I actually wanted to do this after Banjo Kazooie, but due to like time for our summer LPs that I've been planning, I need to get this done before summer ends. And let's just. I don't usually watch these little intro cutscenes, but let's watch them. Yay. So, what is Sonic Adventure? Okay, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I don't plan on doing a whole fucking Sonic series. I'm going to be I'm going to be honest. I'm going to throw this out there. I do love Sonic games. They are really good. They are amazing. There are two taxis. There are three taxis in this one little street. And this is actually kind of a spoiler cutscene, really. But they don't really explain what's going on, so I guess it isn't a spoiler. And this game is one of my favorite games, honestly, from the Sonic series. It's my favorite Sonic game. And only because it's got some of the best storyline, some of the nicest effects, some of the coolest levels. And it's just got some of the best stuff in general. It really is. It's one of the best Sonic games. Um, and this dude here, Chaos, is one of my all-time favorite game characters. Turn it up. No. Uh, yeah, Chaos is one of my all-time favorite game characters. Not to mention, this is the this this the debut the debut the debut of the Egg Carrier, which is another thing I'm a big fan of. I like Eggman's. And this is also one of the first releases of uh, Eggman as we know him, as Eggman, not as Robotnik with his ugly head he got in that one cartoon that no one loves. Cause I love no, I don't really love it. This is more like this. This is actually what Sonic X was mostly based off of. That's kind of Sonic, the good Sonic. The one that's more badass and epic, and when I started liking this game a lot more. And I'm going to try to get as far in this game as I can without getting bored. Which is very easy, because this game, you never get bored in this game. Until one fatal, fatal character. So what's so special about this game compared to most Sonic games? Um, this started the basis for all the Sonic games, where you play as different characters... Uh, I had the volume down because it's a very loud game. Sorry about that. Oh my god, port A, obviously. I have no files. Oh my god. Delete. So yeah, I must have tried to LP this game one time. And, um, anyways. Well, this started a basis where you play as different characters. And it's been carried over to Sonic Heroes and Sonic 2006. And I'm pretty sure there's more. And just for the record, I, I hate people that say Sonic 2006 is awful. I actually love that game. That was an awesome game. Okay, and you see this game, you have various Sonic characters to play as, but we're only allowed to play as Sonic right now. Uh, you play as all of them, you beat the game as all, all the characters, who all have different storylines. And see, unlike most games, you can just beat the game with a different character with different controls, that's it. This game, there's actually different levels for every character, different storyline. You actually see the same storyline with different views, and you gotta like piece it all together pretty much. I'm going to turn the volume up now. Thank you. There we go. And it has some of the best heavy metal music in the game. So let's play a Sonic here. And, yeah, this is one of the only Sonic games besides Mean Bean Machine that I plan on playing. Um, and I really am, I'm, I'm hoping I enjoy this one. I get really far in this one. It has a badass storyline, badass cutscenes, badass everything. It's all badass. And that's that's why I love it. That's what that's what that's what Sonic was made for, guys. This is this is what this is what Sonic was made for. And not to mention also some of the high speed levels that we all love in 3D. Yeah. Because all the other games, let's be honest, all the other Sonic games, they weren't that fast. Come on, man. Either that or they were too fast, and I couldn't control them. This one's got the perfect speed for all the Sonic yeah. games. Yeah, 60s words, and actually this is like early 90s words, in like a late, like a, like a middle 2000s game. What's up? <laughs> I use words like the bomb and shit in this game, and I'm sorry, back in the 1990s, you were like the coolest kid in the block if you said that. Nowadays, it makes you giggle at how stupid it sounds. Oh my god, I don't even, I don't even know if, like, like... Like, I really, I really am not supposed to be LPing right now. But I am. Because I'm supposed to be babysitting still if I like LP. And they're, they're, they're not really. They're, 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 they're actually. They're, they're, they're not. We don't have to worry about them, you know. Anyways. 
He's got a brain. That's the thing new. I've never seen that before. Oh, that's another thing in this game. This game actually has really good AI. That's something you never see anymore. Really good AI programming. Okay. No offense, but it doesn't make sense how a hedgehog can hurt a water monster like this. But bullets can't? Well, actually, it does kind of make sense. You're missing the brain. Yeah. And he put a little light over his brain. Chaos is zero. I thought it was Chouse when I was a little kid. I didn't know I was stupid. Chouse? What the fuck was that? <laughs> okay, anyway, this game was a little bit of glitchy stuff in it. And this is one of the easiest boss fights in the world, I swear. It's just kind of getting used to the controls. Oh, okay. The floor actually disappears when he does this. I don't know why. If you look at the screen properly. Hey, I'll play with you some other time. Okay. Oh. I'm not trying for scores. I am not going to get all the emblems in this game, although I'd love to. I would love to do that, guys. I'm just not going to. Um, I, I can't do it on either version of this game. If you want to play along, you can either buy the Dreamcast version, there's Come a GameCube on, version Chris. with more stuff. Where are you going? And there's actually, this is interesting, there's an Xbox arcade version that's just as much as Banjo-Kazooie, it's 1200 And you buy it, you get this game, you get the Dreamcast version, and if you get like an like a 800 add-on, you get the uh, GameCube add-ons and stuff added to it, levels and all that. And I love this game. You know nothing, fool. It's chaos, the god of destruction. <laughs> I didn't even know who that was when I was a kid. I didn't, you know, I never played Sonic very much. I didn't know who Dr. Robotnik was or any of that. Like, I knew there was a mad scientist, and that was it. I called him the mad scientist. I started calling him Eggman. I never called him Dr. Robotnik, though. I don't care if Banjo-Kazooie is published. Oh, actually, I do care, but still. Not now. He has girly eyes. All of a sudden, he just relaxes. Like, you know what? There's nothing evil going on. No, no evil. Huh? Oh, there is evil. Oh, that's not evil. Evil! What? Hail? And that'll be later explained. Watch out! You're gonna crash! Ah! <laughs> Best voice acting ever! Best voice Ah, uh, Yay! Well, well done, Sega! Woo! Just hey, kidding. Now, what am I gonna do with you? I'll tell you what you're gonna do with him. You're gonna teach him how to talk in proper language as of today. <laughs> Jump over that pool, cause swimming is for losers. And chicks appear out of nowhere. Um, why is it a boy wearing female anime clothes? No, no, dad, no, no. Let's go to the first fucking level and shut up. Okay. And you can't read it. It says Emerald Coast. If you can't read that, um, there you can. And this is a loading screen. It's a really cool loading screen, in my opinion. And. This is actually one of the coolest things in the game. This is just a normal... Yeah, be destructive if you want. Yeah, be destructive. That's, that's the goal in this game. And there's other stuff in this game that I'm not going to be doing either, like chow races. I cannot do the chow races within, 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 for the life of me, okay? And there's also, um... I believe there are, uh... What are they? There's also, uh, mini-games, which I, I couldn't do for the life of me. Well, obviously there's... But I will be looking for all the emblems around the action stages, because they... I have an idea how they work, and where they're all at. And you gotta use certain characters to get to them, but I can do it. I'm good. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe I can. So you go over here, and... Yeah, I don't really need a walkthrough for this level. It's just a... It's just running really, really fast! I love this game. This part is so cool. This is the coolest thing in all of the Sonic series right here. Yeah! That's not a dolphin, that's an orca, but I wanted to call it a dolphin anyways. This is what you get for not playing Orca! <laughs> Echo, Echo the Dolphin was the name of the game. This is what you get for not playing Echo! I think I was the only person who's ever played one of those games, and I absolutely hated it. It was it was an awful game, guys. It really was. It was just, you play the dolphin. And you know I love dolphins. I, I actually literally do love dolphins. They're awesome creatures. And there's nothing special about the game. You play the dolphin. So I will pause here, and I will see you guys next episode. Yay!